Hi, I'm Shane Barry and I'm a concept advisor here at Space Store Healthcare and today I'm going to explain six differences between a phone booth and a video booth. What are the differences between a phone booth and a video booth? It's a great question because there are many differences. We've come up with six key differences we think there are between a phone booth and a video booth. Now the phone booth comes from the original concept in the workplace where you have a little pod you can break out for maybe 15-20 minutes to make a phone call or just concentrate on a bit of work for a short amount of time. The video pod has been a lot more ergonomically designed taking all the factors involved in video. So firstly is size. The phone booth is around 1.2 meters square and is typically used either standing up or maybe perched on a stool for around 15 to 20 minutes whereas the video booth is actually slightly larger which allows space for a larger desk but also an ergonomic task chair this makes it comfortable for use up to four hours secondly is audio visual the phone booth has a standard fixed height desk along with the regular power socket and usb port the video booth has a height adjustable desk which is slightly larger allowing space for a phone and papers whilst on a call it also has a fully integrated PC with a height adjustable monitor as well as a USB-C charging point option along with the regular power connections. Thirdly is lighting. The phone booth has a spotlight in the ceiling which gives us a consistent light whereas the video booth has user controlled bias lighting which enables you to get the best experience on video camera and ensures good representation of all skin tones. Fourthly is privacy. The phone booth comes with a transparent glass door so you can easily see in and out. The video booth comes with a dust and matte film on all the glass panels and this ensures there's privacy for A the consultant and B the patient. The fifth point is accessibility. The original phone booth has a raised threshold meaning there's a step in and out of the pod whereas the video booth has a level threshold meaning there's easy access for wheelchair users as well as there being a push button so the wheelchair can easily open the door. The last point is MEP coordination, and that is not actually applicable to the regular phone booth. With the video booth, there is an optional integral rear access chase, and this allows flexible connection of any MEP components you want to install into the pod, for example a fire sprinkler. So there you have it, six differences between the phone booth and the video booth. I hope you found that insightful and informative so you can make the correct decision when choosing a video booth or a phone booth for your design purpose. If you want to know any more, then please get in touch with me. You can contact me on shane.barry at spacedoor.com or you can give me a call on 07385 518 767. Alternatively, you can head over to our website and book an appointment at www.spacedoorhealthcare.com forward slash bookings. Be glad to hear from you. If you've got any other questions, then please let me know.